was just going to um, say goodbye and <clears throat> I can't take this anymore. I I lied to you. The human whole soul isn't strong enough to cross the barrier alone. It takes at least a human soul and a monster soul. If you want to go home, you'll have to take his soul. You'll have to kill Asgore. I'm sorry. I still really need like a save point. Damn, Behold a save point! The convenience of the save point fills you with determination. <laughs> <laughs> Though I have no items again, so. Yep. If only there's an ice cream salesman conveniently located ahead. Oh, there isn't. If you're looking for a shortcut back to a place you can get items, I think that elevator on the left actually will take you. It's like a shortcut back, essentially, I think. Okay. Look at the big if, city if I remember skyline correctly. there. Elevators in use. So apparently not. Hmm. Right. Like that massive city that we're just walking past. Yep. You know, a lot of those, you know, two towers slightly, you know, wedge shaped apart. Mm hmm. Like all these towers here. Yep. Very utilitarian, yeah. Looks familiar. Yes, it does. The way is blocked by two padlocks. There's a note attached. Howdy, I'm in the garden. If you have anything you need to get off your chest, please don't hesitate to come. The keys are in the kitchen in the hallway. It's a golden flower. There's a heart shaped lock. Lock it inside the box. Will you take it? There's a worn dagger inside the box. What a comfortable bed. If you lay down, you might not ever get up. Twin size bed. There's a lot of striped shirts in here. It's a family photo. Everyone is smiling. It's a drawing of a golden flower. It's dusty toys. More we'll golden flowers. Room under renovations. A long time ago, a human fell into the rooms. Injured by its fall, the human called out for help. Boom clear. Esgore's journal. All the current page says is, nice day today. The ink is still almost wet. Kind of tacky consistency. It's a king size bed. A bureau. There's a Santa Claus outfit inside. It's a clothes drawer. There are robes, button up shirts, and a pink hand knit sweater that says, Mr. Dad Guy. 
It's a trophy. Number one nose nuzzle champion of 1998. Because as you recall, the two dogs were uh, the number two champions. <laughs> Take the key and put it in your phone's keychain. Ezreal, the king's son, heard the human's call. He brought the human back to the castle. Another golden flower. I just came to an interesting realization. <laughs> there are photo albums, scrapbooks, books on how to make tea. Coals are still warm. It's a great reading chair, but it doesn't seem like anyone uses it. Over time, Ezreal and the human became like siblings. The king and queen treated the human child as their own. The underground was full of hope. Trash can. It's full of crumbled up recipes for a butterscotch pie. Stove top is very clean. It's like they use fire magic. You took the key and put on your phone's keychain. It's a note. Howdy. Help yourself to anything you want. There's some white fur stuck in the drain. The fridge is full of unopened containers of snails. You unlock the chain. There's an old calendar from the end of 2016. A date is circled on it. Then, one day, the human became very ill. The sick human had only one request. To see the flowers from their village. But there was nothing we could do. The next day... The next day... Um, the human died. Ezreal, wrecked with grief, absorbed the human soul. He transformed into a being with incredible power. With the human soul, Ezreal crossed through the barrier. He carried the human's body into the sunset. Back to the village of humans. Ezreal reached the center of the village. There, he found a bed of golden flowers. He carried the human onto it. Suddenly, screams rang out. The villagers saw Ezreal holding the human's body. They thought that he had killed the child. The humans attack with everything they had. He was struck with blow after blow. Ezreal had the power to destroy them all. But... Ezreal did not fight back. Clutching the human. Ezreal smiled and walked away. Wounded, Ezreal stumbled home. 
He entered the castle and collapsed. His dust spread across the garden. The kingdom fell into his despair. The king and queen had lost two children in one night. The humans had once again taken everything from us. The king decided it was time to end our suffering. Every human who falls down here must die. With enough souls, we can shatter the barrier forever. It's not long now. King, As king Asgore will, will save, save us, us all. all. You should be smiling, too. Aren't you excited? Aren't you happy? You're going to be free. At all. Oh, nothing bad could possibly happen. Oh, yeah. That's Sans. So, you finally made it. The end of your journey is at hand. In a few moments, you will meet the king. Together, you will determine the future of this world. That's then, now, you will be judged. You will be judged for your every action. You will be judged for every XP you earned. What's the XP? It's Necron. It stands for execution points. A way of quantifying the pain you have inflicted on others. When you kill someone, your EXP increases. When you have enough EXP, your love increases. Love, two is uh, anagram. Anagram. Love, it stands for levels of violence. A way of measuring someone's capacity to hurt. The more you kill, the easier it becomes to distance yourself. The more you distance yourself, the less you will hurt. The, mo the more easily you can bring yourself to hurt others. But you, you never gained any love. Of course, that doesn't mean you're not completely innocent or naive. Just that you kept a certain tenderness in your heart. No matter the struggle or hardship you faced, you survived to do the right thing. You refused to hurt anyone. Even when you ran away, you did it with a smile. You never gained love, but you n never gained love. Does that make sense? Maybe not. Now, you're probably about to face the greatest challenge of your entire journey. Your reactions here will determine the fate of the entire world. If you refuse to fight, Asgore will take your soul and destroy humanity. But if you kill Asgore and go home, monsters will remain trapped underground. What will you do? Well, if I were you, I would have thrown in the towel by now. But you didn't get this far by giving up, did you? That's right. You have something called determination. So as long as you hold on, as long as you do what's in your heart, I believe you can do the right thing. All right. We're all counting on you, kid. Good luck.
throne room. So when's the last time you played an RPG where you're at the final boss and uh, you're at level one? A couple times. It's coffin. There's a name engraved on it. Kira. It's empty. I'm betting there's six others. Mm-hmm. I see only five, though. Well, red, orange, yellow, green, blue. There's an indigo and a violet. That would make seven. Yep. So six plus Kira equals seven. Dum de dum. Oh, is someone there? Just a moment. I have almost finished watering these flowers. Here we are. Howdy, how can I? Oh. I so badly want to say, would you like a cup of tea? But, you know how it is. Nice day today, huh? Birds are singing, flowers are blooming, perfect weather for a game of catch. You know what we must do. When you are ready, come into the next room. It's a throne. It's another throne covered in a white sheet. All right. How tense. Just think of it like a visit to the dentist. It's like it's so sad. He's he's trying to be encouraging. Are you ready? If you are not, I understand. I'm not ready either. This is the barrier. This is what keeps us all trapped underground. If, if by chance you have any unfinished business, please do what you must. I see. This is it then. Ready? A strange light fills the room. Twilight is shining through the barrier. It seems your journey is finally over. You're filled with determination. Human. It was nice to meet you. Goodbye. Esgore tells. You quietly tell Esgore you don't want to fight. His heads tremble for a moment.
you tell him that you don't want to fight him. His breathing gets funny for a moment. No items. Nope. You firmly tell Asgore to stop fighting. Recol recollection flashes in his eyes. Asgore's attack dropped. Asgore's defense dropped. Seems talking won't do any more good. Determined. Yay, determination. <laughs>